<laughs> all right, man. I'm, I'm trying to hold back from not laughing, but um, <clears throat> all right, shalom, shalom to the elect of Yashala. Started with the 144,000 elect men. And shalom to the other Israelite men, women, and children of Yahshua Allah, who Yahweh Yahweh is going to have mercy upon them. I want to start off by giving a much do all phrases, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Racha HaKodash, Koholo Yimla, Abba Nawa, Alahaya Nawa, Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Racha HaKodash. Double honors to the apostles and elders and bishops of Great Millstone, and much due respect to you, sincere Akim, that's laboring in the works. And shalom to you, believers, to the Akim Wa'akwath, which will be your brothers and few amount of sincere sisters who do subscribe to this truth. Abarazazah, this lesson is edifying and plain upon the tables. I'm your brother Malkaya, representing prophets of Pasadena, Texas camp. 77504 branch so you see here in this video looks like something a typical eve you know a wicked israelite woman so-called black hispanic latino native american indian woman would do it says when lighting your ex car on fire goes wrong and play one more time you gonna get some scriptures Stupid, stupid ass Eve, yo. <laughs> you stupid as hell, bro. All right, man. Let's uh, let's get these scriptures very quick. Um, let's see. Uh, let's see. Uh, she is simple and knoweth nothing. All right. So the Book of Proverbs, chapter nine, verse thirteen, in the KJV. A foolish woman is clamorous. She is simple and knoweth nothing. To, you know, our women in general, majority of our women, are clamorous, right? Making a loud and confused noise. They're very loud, let's see. Noisy, loud. Every time when you walk past a Nizzle woman on the phone, you can hear their conversation. They're loud. You can hear an Israelite woman from blocks away. They're very loud. Very vocal. Rowdy. <laughs> Rack, uh, rackedly. Rackedly. Let's see. Shouting. All right. Demanding. Screaming. She is simple and knoweth nothing. Like, why is that for an example? Uh. See, uh, for the most high, Yahweh Bashmi Oshai deprived her of wisdom. Which wisdom? This wisdom and knowledge of the Holy Scriptures. Righteousness. Job 39, verse 17 in the KJV. Because Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai have deprived her, the Israelite woman, of wisdom. Neither have he imparted to her understanding. All right, let's get that uh, Bible gateway right quick. Let's get another version. Let's see that CB right quick. Common English Bible. It says in the Common English English Bible for Job thirty nine seventeen, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai did it endow her with sense. Didn't give her some good sense. Mm, it's pretty decent. Let's see uh, G&T right quick. Mm. Oh, the good news translation. It was I, right? The Lord, Yahweh Bashim, Yahweh Shai. It was I who made her foolish and did not give her wisdom. That's why our women are just bugged the hell out. They're doing shit like this. You try to light a car on fire, and you gonna just light it right there and then. Look, look how close you are to it. Stupid, stu stupid ass Eve, man. That's why you women, a great number of you women, that makes up that two thirds, which is a lot of y'all. Y'all not gonna make it in Jacob's trouble, man. When all hell break loose, 
you know, uh, let's see, um, let's see, oh, no, say, uh, a wicked, oh, matter of fact, no, so lucky, let's get this, let's get this, uh, all wickedness is little, yeah, to the wickedness of a woman. All right, so the book of Ecclesiasticus, also known as Sirach, chapter 25, verse 19. All wickedness is but little to the wickedness of a woman. Let the portion of a sinner fall upon her. Death, death is the, is the portion of a sinner that shall fall upon you, wicked as is like woman. Doing shit like this, man. Trying to burn somebody's car, but that shit backfired on you. You're stupid ass. Um, I think it's G and T, if I'm not mistaken. Let's see. Or is it C B, if I'm not mistaken? Bear with me, Bob Kusha. It says, like, all evil is. Here we go. Alright, so the book of uh, Sirach, right? This uh, book of Ecclesiasticus, also known as Sirach. Chapter 25, verse 19 in the Common English Bible, the CEB. Any evil is small when compared to a woman's evil. May she experience a sinner's fate. Two thirds of our, of our nation, which mostly women, their fate is death. Because they're wicked as hell doing shit like this, man. I'm trying to burn someone's vehicle, but it backfired. On your simple ass. <laughs> ah, damn Eve. But then again, right? Uh, a wicked woman given, oops, luck, yeah. Given to a wicked man, something along that line. Let's see. The book of Ecclesiasticus, also known as Sirach, chapter 26, verse 23, in the KJV. A wicked woman is given as a portion to a wicked man. Whoever that do is, he must be wicked as hell because he was given a wicked woman. But a godly woman is given to him who a man of the Lord. That feareth the Lord Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai. So, wicked men is going to receive a wicked woman as his, as his, uh, you know, like like his partner, right? Like his like a wife, a girlfriend. But but you no, know, the man of the Lord, you sincere brothers, right? Our Lord is not going to give you a wicked woman. He's going to give you a righteous, righteous women, multiple. All right, just not now. All right, but when all hell break loose, you know, brothers will be having, you know, multiple wives on this side, even before entering the kingdom of heaven. Well, I think Isaiah 4 and 1 exists. Seven women shall take hold of one man. When you read that in the uh, expanded Bible, it says how it's like seven women shall take hold of, of one man because like the male population have been uh, decimated, meaning a large portion of the Israelite men. The men of our nation are going to be put to death. All right? uh, a wicked woman is given as a portion to a wicked man. But a godly woman is given to him. Is given to him that feareth the Lord. Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai. A wicked woman is given to the portion of a wicked man. Why do you think this should happen? All right. You think our power, Yahweh Bashmi Yahweh Shai, will let a wicked woman do this to one of his, as he says, uh, you know, uh, men? No, man. All right. Uh, let's see. Micah 7 to 10. A lot of you wicked women thinking that, you know, you about to get away with shit. Nah, a lot of you women are about to be held accountable for your actions, man. Micah 7 to 10, KJV. Then she... That is my enemy shall see it. He is a woman. Starting with the so-called uh, black woman. Right? The Southern Kingdom woman. The head tribe. Tribe of Judah. 
And then, you know, you, you know the Kenyan woman too, and Native American Indian woman. Uh, you see here? All right. Then she that is my enemy, the woman of our nation that is wicked as hell, that's on his 12 tribes chart of Israel, of Yahshua. You see it there? Take a good look, mamita. Take a good look. You want to be wicked? You don't want to repent to Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai and get in order, be righteous? Hey, you're going to be put to fucking death. Play the simple. All right. Then she that is my enemy shall see it, and shame shall cover her, which said unto me, a great humbling, a great heavy spirit uh, resting upon reproach is about to come upon a lot of Israelite women. And shame shall cover her, which said unto me, Where is the Lord, Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh, Shai, thy God? My eyes shall behold her. Now shall she be trotted down as the mire of the streets. You as a light woman, you be talking shit, scoffing and mocking. You're not trembling when you hear these words, all right? Giving the men of the Lord a hard time, all right? You know, that's really you going against our power. So a lot of you women, you is like women are going to see that you are an enemy onto our very creator. And he's going to trot it down a lot of you women as the mire of the streets by putting his spirit, the spirits of vengeance upon a lot of his, a lot of men. You know, these angels are going to be out there putting in work, putting that spirit of vengeance on a lot of men, two thirds of men of the nation of, of Israel, right? Two thirds is like men. The men of the other nations are going to be trotting you women down as the mire of the streets, lying you on fire, raping you. By you no know, multiple men raping you, scriptures goes into that how you know you know raping is going to be something that you know you women you Israelite women are going to uh, experience. That's wicked as hell. Um, being trotting down as the mire of the streets, getting stomped out, dragged, getting probably tied up to a vehicle. And they just driving you all around. You being scraped uh, 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 against the concrete, hitting with bats, you know, weapons that can uh, inflict bo bodily harm. All right, it's not looking too good for a lot of you. It's like women that's wicked as hell that don't want to repent and get right. All right, um, let's get one more. Let me close out. Let's get to Isaiah straight to the point. Isaiah, um. Uh, 32 uh, let's, do, let's do 9 to 10 Straight to the point The book of Isaiah chapter 32 Verses 9 and 10 In the King James Version Rise up ye women That are at ease Right you Israelite women Blacks, Hispanics, Latinos, Native American Indians That's complacent Free from worries That's wanton Right you a whore Right wanton a Sexually unrestrained Right, you're playing a lot of a whore. All right, you're having a good time. You're not trying to get right. You're trying to squeeze in one more summer of a hot girl summer. And then all of a sudden you want to be a wife. Right, you want to live it up still. All right, you want to do you. All right, rise up, you women that are at ease. Hear my voice, the prophets. You careless daughters, give ear unto my speech. Right, and you get able to give ear unto his speech. By hearing his voice, taking heed to the men that he set up with the testimony of Yahweh Shai Hamashiach, the spirit of prophecy. All right. And call all Yahweh Bashmi Yahweh Shai you know, 441, you know, 144, Abaratuza. We, we those elect men. Uh, I'm going to read it again. Rise up, you women that are at ease. Hear my voice, the prophets, that a testimony of Yahweh Shai Hamashiach, the, the, the spirit of prophecy. The elders and apostles and bishops, and great millstone, millstone, and the sincere brothers, you know, on down that comes with the same testimony as out, out in the house and byways pushing out this word, week in, week out, right? Hear my voice, ye careless daughters, give ear unto my speech. Many days and years, so many days to like a year, shall ye be troubled, ye careless women. For the vintage shall fail, the gathering shall not come. Society, when it collapse, America becomes lawless. Everything is taken away from y'all. Second lockdown is about to happen. 
You ain't gonna be able to gather abroad when you please. Being able to travel when you please. Get what you what you please, like umbrellas, your Freddy Cougars, your fake up. All right, and the list goes on. Now when one taken away, all right, your your so called status and power of this world, child support, family first, EBT, um, no security, uh, any kind of assistance from the government, all this shit's about to crash. And the gathering shall not come. Alright. Yo, you is like women. Doing wicked shit like this, man. And worse. Right? You don't want to get right. You don't want to repent. Are going to suffer many things in the times you're coming into, man. Alright? Repent. Or learn the hard way and perish. Seriously, man. Shit's about to get real bad out here. Especially for you is like women. Alright? Paparazzi's out the lesson was edifying, playing upon the tables. And you know, you brothers out there, hey, be careful on who you put your rod into. No, um, be careful on which women you put your rod into because a lot of women are wicked as hell out here, man. All right. Don't fall for the for the, for the the beauty. All right. Don't stumble up, up, upon the woman's beauty, man, because their spirits are black as hell. All right. A lot of our women are black as hell. And I'm talking about the spirit. It's black. It's dark. All right. So be careful, man. Be circumspect. All right. So uh, let's close out by giving a much ado all phrases, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rechaka, Kodash, Koholoyim La, Abadnawa, Allah, Ayanawa, Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rechaka, Kodash. The water I'll be Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, Kaya Rachah Kudas. The water I'll be Yahweh, Kaya Yahweh Shai, Masiyah. Giving thanks to our Heavenly Father for our Lord and Savior, Yahweh Shai, Masiyah. Double honors to the apostles, the elders, and bishops of Great Millstone. And much due respect to you, sincere Akim, that's laboring and works. Shalom to you, believers, to the Akim, Wahakwa. Which will be your brothers and few among the sincere sisters who do subscribe to this truth. DTA, Abad, Babal, Soon, Kwam, Yashallah, and repent. Shalom.